Atalanta, were you here when judgment was passed on the criminal who hangs there? He was a coward. A murderer. I shouldn't say more. Be careful broaching that subject with others. It's a sensitive matter. nature of these beasts to be tamed. What is it, Atalanta? We're headed for Hermes Shrine. Myself and these travelers. Does Lycus know of this? It was his idea. Ah, that desperate fool. And just who are these travelers? My name is Jason. This is Pan. He's unlike the satyrs you may be used to here. A pleasure. Why are you so willing to help us? My purpose here is our own. With or without you, we're going to Hermes Shrine. I wonder if you'll speak so boldly after meeting Abnaji. Nessus, you were the last to venture into the jungles. What can you tell us? Satyrs are closer than ever. Jungles are crawling with them. They've made a den in the cave where one of the sacred herms is located. So expect a fight. Anything else? What is it that you do? A beast master masters beasts. I tame what can be tamed, and kill what can't. Any threat, tamed or killed, except for Hypnage, of course. Have you done battle with Hepnage? She came for me once, out in the jungle. Her first strike caught me by surprise, but my armor turned away the stinger. Fortunate for me, some satyrs were drawn to the commotion. They provided Hepnage with an easy meal while I escaped. There's not a beast alive I can't track. Except her. She's a nasty girl, all right. Thank you for your help, Nessus. Odds are you're heading to your death. Don't thank me for that. Mehene Aurelion. We're heading out. Hermes, guide you there. Traveler, a word of advice. Listen to Atalanta. Follow her lead, and you may come back alive.
anyone care to tell me what's going on? We've seen no other ship land on Saria. Who are these men? Black tongues. Worshippers of the dark titan Hecate. Why do they want to kill Jason? The Black Tongues murdered my wife. They want to make sure she stays murdered. What do you mean? There's a prophecy. They believe her death will bring them great power. We're seeking the Golden Fleece, Atalanta. That's why we're here. That's why we need a descendant of Hermes. You're trying to bring your wife back from the dead? Yes. And as long as I continue, the Black Tongues will try to stop me. Let's keep moving. There are some magnificent natural features here. Just a day's stroll could inspire an entire series of oaths. These cliffs, for example. This place is Mache Seca. Mache Awape. Cursed. Ill luck. Bad things happen here. It's written in Centaur. Will you read it, Atalanta? Oa Kunka le Oblaya Wea. The Great Battle of the Bloody Plains. Yan Apete, Yan Aneti. Three days, three nights. Centaur et Satira. Centaurs and Satyrs. Otto Gazette. Many were the dead. Gilios carved this herm after the battle.
Najee. He's been dead for hours. We couldn't have saved him. I will have that beast hide. Chichita. I will have its hide. There's something unnatural about that beast. I've never heard of a manticore so large. Damn it all. I should have gone with him. I have some blame in his death. I cannot speak the rights. Jason, will you do it? I could do it for you, but I didn't know him. How could I commend his virtues to the gods? I'll tell you what you need to know. Very well. Then let the gods be witness to these last rites. Hear me, swift-heeled Hermes. Mark now the life song of Phalion, fallen scout of the Nisiros. Atalanta, speak of the life and virtues of the fallen so that the gods may hear. Thalion was a brave scout. When others were unwilling to venture into the jungle, he would always volunteer. He was a great singer of songs. His voice would cheer the village, even in our darkest times. He was a loving son. He helped Gelios in his work as Lorgard, and sought medicine for his father, at great risk to himself. And Thalion had a mind for strategy. He helped Nessus form our plan to turn back the satyrs on the bloody plains. A worthy centaur, truly. I will speak of his virtues. Phalion was a gifted singer, whose spirit burned bright even in dark times. May our spirits remain ever strong, especially when they are tested. Phalion of the Nisiros, find now your eternal place. Find now the fate you deserve. You are released from this mortal tether. May unyielding Hades have mercy on your spirit. Thank you, Jason. I... Thank you. When we get back to the village, we must tell Gelios of his son's fate. As for now, the first of the sacred Herms lies just over there. Spirit guide. This land I call my own. Listen for me in the rustling leaves. Hear me in the ocean breeze. The herm has been relit. I've been told the first herms were the work of Hermes' own hands. The second herm is in a cave to the east. Let's go. Atlanta, can you read this herm? Kepa et oyeye waka. Te wapaze leche acte, lechie o makunka. Call to the messenger. He will show you the bridge across the great ravine. Lycus himself carved this herm. Up there, across the gulf. That's where we want to go. The impassable chasm. Times like these, we earthbound creatures, how we envy the flight of birds, no? Come, let's relight the second herm and then return. This is where I killed my first satyr. I was probably around eight or nine. I was cleaning a manticore when Nessus was the last to enter the jungle and return. He said the satyrs made a den in the cave ahead. During the day, they'll likely be outside. Oh, my God. 
inside the cave. There are stories all around you, even in dark, secluded places. Share your stories. Mark the places where they were born. No greater gift can you give to one another. The Herm has been remit. If what we've heard is true, we've just built ourselves a room. To the ravine. The way across should be ready for us. Atlanta, can you read this herm? Leo Lewamaxa, Hypnage ni Woyate Toko Tokato. Here was the beast Hypnage first seen. Alef Le Chiosokewan, the chief of the jungle now. Iwaka, Iyuk Omani Leo, Gazet Awe Le Mache. Beware. All who travel here, death stalks this land. Nessus made this herm, the last herm the Nisiros made on Saria. He went out alone into the jungle to place it, felt it was our duty to warn any who came here. Jason, over here, left caps. Gather them, Atalanta, hurry.
always loves a prank. Let's hope this bridge isn't one of them. There's no one here. And no sign of Hypnage's lair either. Kichita. Not here, then where? Let's look about. Keep our eyes open. Jason, look! That fruit! Not any fruit I've seen before. If it's what I suspect, very few people have. This is a caduceus tree. See the roots? They resemble the entwined snakes of Hermes' staff. I've never seen it bear fruit before. The centaurs say it blooms when Hermes has been near. It is also said that whomever eats of the fruit can see through the eyes of Hermes himself. Know this, Jason. I've heard tales of great men who ate of the Caduceus fruit and never quite recovered. Claimed they saw things that weren't there. Heard voices when no one else called. It's clear Hermes has led us to this fruit. I trust this is what he wants me to do. Atlanta. Pan! Don't worry about them. They're fine. You'll catch up to them in a moment. Hermes? The fruit. I feel... Sorry about the taste. Was aiming for a sort of pomegranate. Came out more like the sole of a sandal. Oh well. I saw Alcime. You saw lost spirits, your wife among them. Unlike the others, she is under my protection. For now. How long can you protect her spirit, Hermes? I must know. She'll be lost before you see her again. And so you face a hard choice. Return now, and give her last rites to save her from that fate. Or, find the fleece, and bring her back entirely. That choice has already been made. Then know this. As a lost spirit, she will wander for eternity, slowly losing all memory of who she was in this world. Only you, who are most intimate with her, can perform the last rites to put her spirit to rest. Should you die during your quest to find the Golden Fleece, then Alcime would be lost forever. I know what you seek here, but the time is not yet right for the one who carries my blood to be revealed. What would you have me do? The Nasiros are a good people. You must end their suffering. By slaying Hepnage? There's another evil on Saria far greater than that. One you must uncover and destroy. How? The fruit has given you new eyes. 
Ones that can peer into the spirit world itself. Go and find the lost spirits that roam this island, and give to them last rites. Talk to them. The dead hold the key, Jason. In their dwindling minds, you'll find the answers that you seek. We lost you there for a moment, Jason. I spoke with Hermes. We have more work to do. What must we do? We must speak with the spirits of the dead. The fruit I ate allows me to see them. There's something going on here. Something more than just hypnosis. What do you mean? A greater evil. Hermes says the dead will tell us more. A greater evil than hypnosis? But what? Spirit, do you see it? No, Jason. Only I ate the fruit. Only I can see them then. The jungle is unsafe. Not, Not safe, safe for anyone. Hermes sent me to help you find rest, Spirit. Run, my child. Run to safety. Who is your child? Who do you tell to run? Where can I find your body? Where did you die? We thought the cliffs were safe. That there was no danger there. Lysander, protect our daughter. Lysander? What? That's my father's name. And your mother's? It was Pelagia. Your parents were great people, Atalanta. The assassin and the oracle. What? What are you talking about? My wife was murdered because of a prophecy given to her father by the oracle Pelagia. For that she was marked for death by the Black Tongues. But the assassin sent to kill her instead fell in love. That assassin's name was Lysander. Together they fled and disappeared from history. They came to Saria to hide. Your parents could have many insights to share. Both about the evils on Saria, and about the Black Tongues. We must do as Hermes asked. Go to her final resting place and give her last rites. <laughs>